we're back. Welcome everyone to tonight's stream. Hope everyone's having a good day. Just want to double check some things, make sure everything's all set up correctly. So everything looks like I set it up correctly, but I've been known to be wrong before. <laughs> Excuse me. Just cleared my throat there. Okay, for some reason, why does this always change in the category? I set it up for set up for Skyrim, but it always changes back. It's like that's not what I want at all. Okay. Now I also have to turn down my headset a little bit. A little too loud. One second. Oof! Okay, that's a little too loud. When in doubt, just shout. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Let me double check, make sure that category changed so people can find me. Come on. Alright, looks like it went through okay. Da da da. Just double checking. I think everything's okay now. I think. But like I said, I've been known to be wrong before. Thank you, Stream Elements, for reminding me that I'm actually playing now. Let's see. Do, do, do. Okay, looks like everything's working according to plan. Like I said, I hope everyone had a good evening today. It's Sunday, St. Patrick's Day. So hopefully everyone drank responsibly didn't drive and drink, so that would be bad. Okay, so let's see. So tonight I'll be streaming again from 8 to 10. <clears throat> Lydia, we just left there. Sometimes I worry about you, Lydia. And again, I still have to get used to wearing a headset and hearing myself speak, because I'm still muffled. All movement over there. Oh, I hear a dog barking. Nice. Oh, Lydia, come on. There we go. I didn't want to hit you. Oh, nice. You equipped that ebony mace I gave you. Very nice. Oh no, I forgot. I am over encumbered like crap. All right, let's see, what can I drop? Ooh, wait. Nice, it's filled with a grand soul. I'm just going to assume that this is King Olaf's soul because we just killed him last night. All right, let's see. Gotta drop that wolf pelt. Just one. All right, so tonight we're just gonna do a little bit more exploring. We got another word of power. Let's see. I think the word that I got was another part of Kind's piece. Alright, let's see. Do do do. Uh, looks like everything's still. Just checking to make sure everything's still working. Working well. Okay. Let me check the map. Alright, so I'm gonna head towards Morthal. No, I don't want to fast travel. I actually just want to walk there. Because who knows what I what trouble I can get into between here and there. But I have been to Morthal once before. What's this over here? Oh, okay. Uh, so this way, at least, if I head towards here, I can start selling stuff. And this way, I'll have more room to take stuff. And all that jazz. Oh no, wait, did I kill this? Uh, let's see, I'm just gonna eat that. Okay, I don't think I killed that deer. Oh! There we go. But I do want to improve my archery. There we go. And I got a soul. Jeez. But unfortunately, I don't have any carrying capacity. Wait, wait. Oh god! Get away. 
Well, at least we now figured out what killed that previous deer. There we go. Right, you, I'm gonna steal. Yeah, I'm not gonna steal. I'm gonna equip that. Let me just heal myself. Uh, there we go. Are you a priest? There we go. Are you a priest? No. Lydia, you just. I don't know. I... Whoa! Ooh. Get away from me. Man, I wasn't kidding. Look at all the trouble I'm getting up to between here and Morfall. It's like, I might as well just... Yeah, look, there's a bear all the way up there. I'm gonna see if I can get it. Oh, I missed. That's not good. It knows. Go, and... Get away. Let's see if I can improve my destruction. Oh, I gotta stuff my face full of food. Also, I gotta lower my, my headset volume. It's a little too high. Uh, I don't really need to improve my stamina. That's not gonna work. Wait, wait. At least this way I'm also losing a lot of weight in my inventory. Point of health that's restoration. Let's see. Yeah, it's good enough for now. There we go. <laughs> now I could have used flames, but I think sparks also damages their stamina, I think. Uh, no, I got some extra. Oh no, I thought I had carrying capacity. I don't. All right, well, we drop one. There we go. Also, uh, let's, there we go. This way, once my meter refills. Wait, what necklace am I wearing? I just realized, I'm like, what amulet do I have on? Oh, okay, good. Good, good, good. That is what I want. Oh, I just noticed, Phil Pill, thanks for the host. I give you a quick shout out. Ow, just hit myself in the hell. <laughs> I was gonna say, just hit myself in the headset. There we go. Shout out for Bill. Thank you. Thanks for the host. I appreciate it. How was your stream? Looks like you were streaming Batman Arkham City. Let me just adjust my headset because I just hit myself. <laughs> I didn't gauge the, the distance between my head. There we go. <gasps> oh, jeez. What killed you? I am running across a lot of dead animals lately. It's like there was that deer, or another rat, the giant spider. It's like I didn't kill you. But normally I'm surprised that there's not like a giant in the area. Typically you see mammoths only around giants. Or at least I have. Right, is there anything else around here? I don't see any movement. Ooh, there's a fort over there. But no, I have to continue on to Morthal. It's like no matter how enticing and tempting that may be to pillage and plunder, I have no carrying capacity. <gasps> a bridge. It's over there. Oh. I see you, mud crab. Ow. Well, that was anticlimactic. Try that once again. Oh, no, I missed him. Oh. All right, well. <sighs> so I gotta stop. Oh, look, there's another elk over there. There's that deer. Let's see. I wanna get down there. There we go. Its soul is mine. Let's go this way. It's a little bit of a safer path. Okay, so Morthal is over this way. And I see a deer 
over there. Nice, it's soul is mine. Oh, I saw something else over here. Nah, just my imagination apparently. But I know there's a mud crab under this bridge that's gonna try and fight me. So I'm gonna take the fight to him. Come on, mud crab. I know you're around here somewhere. It's like I can hear it. Oh, there's my arrows. There we go. I think I've lost Lydia again. She doesn't do really all that well on uh, mountainsides. I'm just gonna follow this road. See where it takes me. I might. I might not stay on the road. Oh, oh! Look at you guys. I think I'm gonna save because I'm gonna get up to trouble. This doesn't concern you, citizen. Oh, I think it does. Who are you? I am a Thormor Justiciar on important business, but you are in Justiciar. Uh, what are you doing? We're making sure your emperor wasn't lying to his elven masters when he agreed the empire would give up false gods. They're talking about Talos. Now go away. No, I don't want to go away. Talk to me again. Oh, good, Lydia, you showed up. Interfering with official Thormor business. <laughs> that we are superior to men is an established fact. For example, take this belief in Talos, the ninth divine. <laughs> Certainly you don't believe such things. I think no matter what I answer something you'd like to confess Yeah, I think no matter what I answer they're gonna start fighting me whatever like It doesn't matter. So I'm gonna remain silent. I don't like yeah, see you. I think you're a heretic And so you will die. Yeah, heretic. it's like I there is no backing out of this fight. Okay I'm talking to you free and let me give you a weapon because why not? Uh, what do I got do I have anything to give you? Um, it's like I don't really want to give you any of these. <laughs> I like my things. Uh, sure, I'll give you this dagger, because why not? Quick change my shout. Uh, eh, no. I'm not gonna change my shout. <gasps> Whoops. Friendly fire. <gasps> no! I didn't mean to... I now have a bounty on my head. <gasps> no, I shot Lydia. Oh my god, this is not going well. <laughs> this is not going well at all. I did not mean to shoot Lydia. I had fire in my eyes. Oh, I accident. I think I accidentally uh, killed that dude. But also, he didn't really stand a chance because I didn't give him any armor either. Whoops. This is not going well at all. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> okay, let's see. What can I do? Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna chug some of these potions. Chug some stamina. I'm gonna use a two-handed potion. Or a two-handed weapon. Nice! I always I always appreciate the uh, cinematic. Oh, I think in the upper left-hand corner it just said my bounty was removed. Because basically everybody here who is a witness is dead. So let's uh, double check that. So go to crime. That's it. So total lifetime bounty is 43. 43? Oh, I think I got caught stealing. Largest bounty was 40. See, so yeah, I don't think I have a bounty right now, currently, at the moment. Uh, Alright, let's see. What can I take? The nice thing about elven armor, or at least light armor, is it's super... As it says, light. Uh, I think I have... I have a shield. Aww. Uh, sorry, dude. I'm gonna take that, back that dagger, though. You put up a good fight. Let's see. What can I put on you? I'm just gonna give you a wolf pelt or two. Just to lighten up my load. Uh, 
uh, oh, some of these bodies rolled down the hill. Ooh, taking that. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have the carrying capacity. Or do I? Let's see, what can I dump on you to make up room in my inventory? Oh wait, no, I don't have to. I have a potion. Strength. So it's gonna buy me some time. I think there was one other person. Oh, they're right there. So I didn't have to get into a fight, but it was fun. I'm gonna take all this, because now I have the extra carrying capacity. And if I make it to town before that potion wears off, I can sell that for cash. Is this looking like a win-win for me? Turn that battle around, make a hefty profit. Oh, wait, let me improve my skills. If I can. Oh, wait, more falls over there. I might make a shortcut and just cut through the woods. Uh-oh. Lydia! Lydia, you gotta watch out. I didn't know you were gonna go there. <laughs> Spider is just rolling down the side. Oh, it's like I thought I heard something on my left ear. <gasps> I got a quick shove food in my face. <laughs> uh, let's see. I can hear my heart beating. Let's see. I know I have potions. Keep eating these stews. Let me get a potion. Okay. Good job, Lydia. You have saved the day. Wait, come back. I have to take the poison off of you. And poison my my weapons here. Go. Here we are. Okay. On the road again. Can't believe I didn't die on the road again. Uh, let's see. How far... Oh, okay. So I could just quick make a left. Alright, that's what I'm gonna do. Wait, wait. Here we go. Snowberries. And just like that, we're in Morthal. What time is it? Okay, it's like midnight. It's after midnight. So I don't believe anything is gonna be open. I forgot I still had that quest on. Oh, you're a courier. For you. Got something I'm supposed uh, to deliver. Did a friend of mine die? Am I in trouble? Let's see. Did I inherit some wealth? Not sure who from. Oh, I wouldn't say. Just say because a friend, a friend quote unquote, like heard me it. shout in a specific area, and they're like, "Hey, go to this place. Find a word of power." I don't know if I ever found out who this quote unquote friend was. Uh, it's not it. This is it. Yeah. So, basically, if you use your shout in, sp in uh, different areas, you'll get these letters. And you'll be like, hey, this is from a friend. Go here. Hey, courier, do you have anything else? Nope. Okay. Sorry. No. What are you guys doing? Heard they're reforming the you look suspicious. Vampire I'm gonna keep going, though. Old fort near uh, let's see. Okay, so the, yeah, this is a shop. Oh, there's an inn. I can actually get a good night's rest. I'm gonna walk around here because I haven't quote unquote discovered these houses yet. Oh, nice. Use this real quick. Some, somehow added to the weight. I 
have to get rid of three pounds. Let's see. Yeah, let me just eat stuff. You have to be heavy, though. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait, wait. Let's just start drinking. Because I don't need any of that. Okay, there we go. The one thing I am just kind of disappointed in is no matter how much you drink, it doesn't seem to affect your character any any bit. Like, you don't seem to be getting, like, impaired visually or your dexterity goes down or anything like that. I don't know, I think that would just be a neat little addition. There's probably a mod for it, but I don't have mods on my game right now. Because I want those achievements. Look at this. This is such a nice scenery. Very quiet and serene. So I think I'm gonna head towards the end so I can at least get a, a good night's sleep so I can get the rested achievement. I don't think I'm gonna get well rested because it's not like I own the bed. Hey, you. Welcome to the moor side. If you need anything, I'll be around. Oh, what's with the orc? Lurbuck? He's <laughs> himself a bard. He pays, so I let him stay. If I had any customers, he's part of quest later on. Knowing them, but well, <laughs> look around. Uh, is business slow? Oh, no, it just it's just non-existent. Few enough reasons to pass through Morthal before the war started. Now, well. Let's just say the front door doesn't get much use. Uh, where can I learn about magic? Nobody here likes magic. I'm looking for Falian? Why don't you go bother those mages at their college in Winterhold and leave my brother alone? Let's see. Oh, what's the story? Rogar's house? It burned down not too long ago. It's a real pity about his wife and kid. The screams woke half the town. Most folk won't go near it now for fear it's cursed. How did it start? Rogar claims it was a hearth fire. Some folks say Rogar started it himself. Oh no. That's what they say. See, he's living with Alva now. That started the day after the fire. That seems kind of quick. Like moving in with a new love the day after your kin died oh, like that. Oh, jeez, no. <laughs> of course, they can't prove he uh, murdered him. Our Jarl would sure like to know if he did, though. Might even pay to find out. Did you say payment? <gasps> Look at that. I just started a new quest. Nice. Thanks, lady. You just got me some money. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Nice. Uh, what do you got for sale? I know you have salt. Give me all your salt. Uh, no. <gasps> Sweet roll. But I can't sell you really anything else. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Let's see. Can I take your cheese? Oh no! I think my potion wore off, so now I am very slow. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Nah, I'm good. <gasps> Look at that bag of gold just sitting on the floor, tempting me. Oh, no one's looking. Nice. Hi, good evening, Anna. Whoa. What can I get you, Alva? What can't you get me? <gasps> you hussy. Um, did you want something to eat? I don't think I've ever seen this interaction. No, I don't think I'm hungry. Not now. It's as suspicious as shit. Right. Okay. Uh, tell me. It's like, what are you doing in my tavern? Get out. It's like, what do you want? Oh no, I can't catch up to you. I'm too slow. All right. Well, I'll just time to sleep. All right. So that'd be three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I at least want to wake up in time for the shop to open so I can sell stuff. So I can finally stop being over encumbered. Ooh, well rested. So I did get that that uh, bonus. Probably because I paid for this bed. Alva, what are you doing here? You own a house. Why? What were you doing in there? Oh, there's the orc. Don't fret over the gloom. There's nothing to fear. You don't really look like an orc. Like when I think of orc, I think Just like big and bulky and towering. You look like just someone slapped an orc face on top of a regular person's body. I'm a bard, trained at the Bard's College in solitude. Wanderers like you should think about I fire. think I will. 
All right, goodbye, sir. Until next time. All right, time for me to slowly mosey on out. So yeah, I guess renting a room also gives you the perk of being well rested in that it, for the next like eight hours in game time, you get a 10% bonus to, let's see, oh wait, well rested. Oh no, I still have a taxia. Damn it, I gotta find somewhere to pray. Yeah, all skills improve 10% faster for the next eight hours. Stupid ataxia. All right. No, I can hear you, Nernroot. I just don't want to get you. What? There we go. Magic. Magic, child. Thalion says I'm good at learning. My mother and father died. Oh no, you're an orphan. Thalion takes care of me now. Hello. Hey, you want to play a game? No, I'm over encumbered. I Figures. can't right now. You elders <gasps> are always so blind. No, what's up, fellow Skyrim children? <laughs> Hey you, lady, you look like you got a quest for me. Don't take this the wrong way, but you look a little sickly. I know, I got a taxia. Do you want it? <laughs> Alright. It's like York is the subtitle's saying York, but it's not saying anything. Oh, do come in. I hope I have what you need. I hope you do too. And what I need right now is to offload all of my goods. But first, I have to change my outfit, so you'll give me a better deal. Uh, let's see. It's hagging, haggling necklace. There we go, necklace, and I have a hood. And just like that, I'm a better dealer. I don't Wait. get many customers, but that leaves what? me time to try. What are all these kids out? doing here? Get out! I guess. I Betray me first. I think I can teach you a thing or two. Maybe. Ah, good. So now let's see what I can sell ah, so you're an to get my gold back. Oh no, I can't sell any armor or weaponry. I could sell some of my potions. It's, it's, I have a tendency to keep like a lot of potions. It's like, oh, I may use this later. And then here, I don't use them later. That's my downfall. Hold on to everything, thinking I'm gonna use it. Oh, I can get rid of these though. <gasps> no, I didn't mean to sell that. Damn it. What did I do? Uh, I'm just gonna buy these both. Because I didn't mean to sell whatever that was that I just sold. <laughs> I was very trigger happy. Lydia, what are you- Oh, right I'm no longer over encumbered. Man, really, he's not. Let's see, what do you got? What do you have for me, Lydia, that you're not currently using? Uh, I'll leave you with these because I can't sell her any weaponry or apparel. What are you wearing, though? Let me give you the other orc armor and see which one you prefer. Oh, you can't take it. Oh. But you don't really spell cast. I'll leave that on you. Right there. Alright, so... Ah! Take these bones off you. And sell her those bones. What do you want, cat? Excuse me, I am a paying customer, madam. Ah, you will show me some understand. respect. As a side note, no one in Skyrim likes Khajiit. Uh, I don't really want to sell you any of my ingredients. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me just offload some of these potions. Like, what can I get rid of? That might come in handy. Until I at least enchant something with water breathing abilities. Just get rid of those. That's not bad. That's not bad either. Okay. A lot of these are duplicates, too. I'm gonna keep those, though. Those are good. Uh, sorry, I want to keep these drugs. I mean... Medicinal uses. Alright. So I got a pretty good amount of gold. 
Good day. And of course, I can't sell her any of my stolen goods. Now, this, I feel, is cheating on Skyrim's part. They put all this stuff here. So when I go over to use the alchemy lab, I could accidentally steal something Perhaps. in plain sight. I don't know what it is. All right. It's like I call that cheating. It's like I just want to use the lab. No, I'm sorry. Time to experiment. Um, I find it. Make sense? If it does to you, dear, that's all that matters. It's like I'm not- oh wait, I keep those fire salts, because I know... That's actually towards a quest. Nice! Something came in handy. It's like, wait, now I'm gonna keep those too, because I need those for a quest as well. It's like, some of this is just trial and error. It's like, I could pay attention to the properties of each item, but I'm not gonna. Actually, Nern Root and... Uh, vampire Dust. Or was it... Maybe it wasn't that... No, there you go, invisibility. It's like, I knew you could do that. Oh no! I now I have nothing for Ingrin. Or Ingen, or whatever her name is. That quickly, quickly I forgot. And I could have used... Yeah, vampire dust. Let's see. That's always a good potion for carrying weight. Definitely something I will put into good use. Oh wait, no, I gotta keep those. Alright, I'm gonna quit alchemy for a little bit. Can't cook anything. Look at all these nice potions that are well within reaching ability. They're well within my grasp. Everything's all nice and orderly. It's like looking's free. I can look. I can't take. I didn't take anything. You can't call the police on me. The Skyrim Popo. Look at all those bags of gold she just has sitting underneath her table. Someday, I'll be back. And I'll rob you blind. Okay, let's see. Alright, so I got rid of some weight. Uh, but I can go cash in on a bounty. Nope. Sorry, nothing. I didn't ask you anything, courier. Leave me be. Alright, let's see. Just check in chat, just make sure I don't miss anything. One second. Now, oh, yes, you. Give me money. I killed I do somebody. Do what I can to see that Idgrud's time isn't wasted. Yes. Excellent. You've done us a great Pay service. Pay me. Here's your reward. Looking, ooh, 100. Ah, that's not too bad. All right, mm -hmm. I'm gonna talk to the Arl, find out what happened with that house. You look sick. I yeah, I know. Contagious. I'm gonna bite you. Let's see how contagious it is then. Brogar's house fire? Nom nom nom. Well, nom he nom. lost his wife and daughter in the blaze. How unfortunate. My people believe it to be cursed now. Who am I to gainsay them? You're the Jarl. Brogar blames his wife for spilling bear fat in the fire. No, I don't think that's it. I think he set the fire himself. I think that's it. Why would he do that? Lust can make a man do the unthinkable. The ashes were still warm when he pledged himself to Alf. That foul temptress. That hussy. On rumor and gossip? No. But you a stranger. I'm a stranger. I can just do some snooping. Sift through the ashes that others are too fearful to touch. See what they tell you. It's like, if I'm wrong, then it's, you know, no one's to blame. Nice. Uh, I understand you have visions. The vines reveal things to me at times, yes. I do not hide this. So that's, that's fearful to some of the people here. ...does not and cannot understand it. Alright, I'm gonna back you out. I know. Too many bother my wife with their Whoa, whoa, whoops. ...and then don't even understand the advice she gives them. Please don't mind Yorick. He's not that. There's too many people. I just want to go up the stairs here. You go up. It's like, I thought there was an enchanting table around here somewhere, but apparently I was wrong. Oh, 
now. I want to enchant. I have so many soul gems to use. Alright, let's go investigate. This murder. <gasps> Chicken. Oh wait, I'm still wearing my helmet. Or my, uh... That person just quickly walked into that house. Still wearing my Thieves Guild hood. I'm gonna change out for my helmet. And let's see. Put on this necklace. The amulet. Oh wait, chicken. Oh, there's chickens. There are eggs. Part of a balanced breakfast. And this is not stealing. These are eggs are free. So free eggs. Free range eggs. Can't arrest me now. Alright. Investigation. <gasps> What's up, kid? Who's there? Is that you, father? It's the crucible child. <laughs> Help me. The father says Just less annoying. To talk to strangers. Are well, you a stranger? No. I'm a friend. The smoke woke me up. I was hot and I was scared. So I hid. Oh, no. Then it got cold and dark. I'm not scared anymore, but I'm lonely. Will you play with me? Uh, sure. I bet you're super great at hide and go seek. Okay, let's play. Hide yeah. <laughs> you find me, and I'll tell you. It's like, oh crap. We have crap. to wait for nighttime, though. The other one is playing too, and she can't come out until then. It's like what other one? I can't tell you. She might hear me. She's so close. It's like who? Where? You find me first. I can tell you. That's all right. Up. <laughs> And there she goes, she's just gone. Alright, so I gotta wait for dark. I don't wanna wait for dark. Well, let's see. Okay, what is around here? I don't think there are any other shops in this town. This is a house. House. It's an inn. It's a hut. Uh, a guard house, a house, house. So yeah, this town is basically just the Jarl's hut, or the, the hall, one shop, one inn, and like four or five houses. This is not a very bustling economy here in Skyrim. It's like, uh, there's no one I can sell my armor or... That means something. Oh yeah, I beat you up, dude beat you up in a fist fight and now I'm a good friend who just kicked your ass. Means light on your feet. Smart. Yeah, this is not a very good town for me to try and sell armor and equipment. So I gotta find another village. Take these though. Cause Ing and Blackbriar needs them. There we go. Ooh. The mill is my responsibility. And that's what I care about. Alright, let's see. Then where else is the nearest town? I think it's Solitude is the nearest one. But I haven't found that one yet. Let me remove my land marker. I could go to Dawnstar. But I think I'm going to run into the same issue where there's not a whole lot of shops. But Solitude isn't too far away. And there's a lot of shops in Solitude. So I'm gonna put my marker right there. So it's like, do I want to head there now or do this quest? Choices. I'm thinking I'm gonna do the quest. First, a quick swim. Oh. This is all waist high. And. <gasps> yes! Aha, I see you, mud crab. Nice. It sold as mine. Oh wait, now it's getting deeper. Oh, I can't... I can't aim at anything. I'm kind of in trouble here. There we go. Ooh, and another noon root.
anything interesting around here. Alright, well I'm gonna head back to the inn. I think I can actually use that bed again. I know they said it's yours for a day, but I think they mean a 24 hour cycle. Oh, I just noticed someone else is hosting me. Thank you. Let me just give you a quick shout out. Thank you for the host. I appreciate it. There we go. Okay, let's see. What do you got under here? <gasps> here the steward asked you to look into the fire. They did. Do you got anything else? Oh, so good. oh you, feeling all right? you do have something. The poor child is probably begging for us to string up her murder and fall. Yeah. It's like Best the town God. knows it. Uh... Until next time. Yeah, I guess I can tell the Jarl what I saw. That would probably be a good idea. Can I sleep in this bed? Oh, I can. Alright, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sleep for seven hours. I'm a tired cat. This way I'll get another well rested bonus. I'm gonna go talk to the Jarl. Who are you guys? If you've business with the Jarl. I'd nah. ask that you speak to me first. Alright, I spoke to you. Morthal used to oh. be quiet for I us. beat you up. Uh, the world used to make my sense. mind weighs heavy enough. Until next time. Leave me to my food. No, I'm a nosy Parker. What do you what do you, what's, what's wrong? Is, uh, Besides your a problem. morning star yes. clipping through the bench. I'm worried about Idgrid. And I don't know what to do. Who? What's the problem? She is so lost in the Oh, vision. Ingrid, I think, is the uh the Jarl. Was. I've looked after her safety for so long. If she can't tell what's real and what's not, how will she continue to lead Hjalmarch? I think she'll do an okay job. Is there what yes. can I do? I suppose there is. There is a letter. One I have had for some time. I don't think I've actually spoken to him. I don't think I've done this one at all. Time it gets delivered. I cannot leave Idgrid's side. See, Skyrim, you so keep surprising me after like eight Could years. You see that it reaches Captain Aldous in solitude. Oh, I'm gonna read this note. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> do not open it. I am super opening it. Private. Until next time. You know what? I'm gonna open this here right in front of you while you're watching me. I bet it's a note telling the captain that, hey, uh, you gotta send a new Jarl. All right, let's see. I don't remember what the note was called. I'm probably skipping right by it. All right, slowly. It was probably his name. Yep, there we go. Look, dude, I'm reading your letter. <gasps> Uh-oh, I'm gonna go snitch on you. I'm gonna go tell the Jarl that you're trying to undermine her authority and oust her from her seat. And hopefully then she'll pay me for being such a good snitch. It's like there was no wax seal on that envelope. <laughs> she just... Okay. Skyrim, I'm getting concerned about you. Oh, Inga... Okay. That's why you have the same name. That's a daughter. Okay. Yo, what's up? Is Hrogar innocent or not? Oh no, I can't. Sn I can't snitch. The spirit world. But I can just talk about these ghosts. Place. Look to the graveyard. That is where you'll find her. Oh, you're just helping me cheat at hide and go seek. Hrogar's fate is in your hands. Hrogar is gonna die, I think. Possibly, maybe. Let me talk to you. Please don't. I don't. I haven't oh. mother's gift. Not quite. Man, I can't snitch to anybody about this note that I just read that I was told explicitly not to read. Then what's the whole point? <sighs> Alright, well, I guess when I get to solitude, I'll turn it in. Maybe. Wait, what's here? Is there anything? Ooh, yes. Something worth stealing. There we go. Time to go find a ghost and bust it. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Right, does that? I don't think I have that mission. Nope, I don't have the mission on. Uh, let's see, is there anything else? No. Wait, yes. 
I know, no, no. Alright, everything is on that I want on. And I should quick save while I'm thinking about it. Uh, let's see. I think the graveyard is up this way. Maybe? Yes. Maybe? Yes. Wait. There we go. Ooh, wait. I should check the ingredients to see if there's anything I can eat. To find out their magical properties. It's like everything I eat now, I only get one description. So there is a skill that if you level up, you can increase your ability to find two properties. Yo, what's up? Um. <laughs> back up and like shout but I think that works too good job Lydia you have earned your keep uh oh it's like I wonder what her deal was <laughs> all right time to take everything off of you let's see there's already a grave here she's dead there we go she's she's a vampire a vampire you found me! Whoa! Laylot was trying to find me too, but I'm glad you found me first. Where are you? Laylot was told of her mommy and me. Oh. She didn't want She's to. dead. He's... He I'm just talking to this coffin. Forever She's and ever. Vampire. Forever and ever. She kissed me on the neck, and I got so cold that the fire didn't even hurt. Laylot thought she She's could dead. take me and keep He's me, feared. but she can't. She's, She's a vampire. Oh, jeez. Dude, tiny. calm down. I'm sleep for a while now. So the kid's dead. That... Vampirism didn't take for the kid. Dude! She's dead. Stop! Beard. You've She's been dead. saying that. Layalette is dead. Yeah, I know. Lydia did it. Layalette. I thought she left to join the Stormcloaks. Nope. Oh, my poor Layalette. She... She joined something a bit more eternal. She began to spend a lot of time with Alva. She also stayed indoors. Like she hated before. garlic. She avoided she the sun. But no, other than that, she didn't change. The night she disappeared, she was supposed to meet Alva. Uh-oh. Alva told me later that she never showed I up. I think Alva's a lying bitch. I never got to tell her goodbye. Oh, well. I'm sure she knew. You think Alva? Yeah. But that means... Ye gods... You think Alva is a vampire? No, duh. Yeah. No, you're wrong. You must be wrong. Leolette may have met her fate out in the marsh. You idiot. I refuse to believe Alva had anything <laughs> to do with this. There is no way you can prove it to the Jarl. No way, he I says. Alva is not what you think. No way, he says. Now, the thing is, when dealing with vampires, you have to be really careful because you do have the ability to catch vampirism. Like, if they, I don't know, attack you, you can get infected. But if you don't heal yourself within a span of three days, you contract vampirism. Which uh, increases, like, in strength over several days. Like, there are different stages to vampirism. And I think because I have the Dawn Guard, was it Dawn Guard DLC? Yeah. The Dawn Guard DLC. I think with that... Before that DLC, what would happen is if you reached like level four, the highest level, that everyone would see obviously that you're a vampire and they would get super mad and they would attack you on sight. Hey Alva. I hear you put Laylette out of her misery. Yeah, I did. You're next. <laughs> Bye. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah. I think prior to that DLC, everyone would notice you're a vampire and then just attack you on sight. But I think with this DLC it's not so noticeable that they don't attack you. But you still get, like, what's the word? Uh, disadvantages from being a vampire. I mean, obviously, there's something advantageous to it. Like, you have some advantages, like strength and everything. But, of course, you're going to get hit with, like, damage by the sun, double damage to fire. Is Rogar innocent or not? He's super guilty, but... I gotta go investigate this lady's house. 
But of course, it's not good. Whoa! Skyrim, I am getting super worried about you. <sighs> Skyrim. Right, let's see what time is it. All right, I don't want to sleep again. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. Hmm. Actually, no. I'm gonna go back to sleep. See if my room is still taken, or if I have to re-rent the same hotel. I was gonna say hotel room, but it's not a hotel room. It's an inn. Let's see. Morthal used to be a quiet hey, Alva. Place, people here work so hard. The world nope. To make sense. Let's see. Can I sleep in this bed or is it gonna stay occupied? Nope. Alright, so that's 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Alright, sleep for 10. I'm doing a lot of sleeping this episode. So obviously, vampires are nocturnal. So when I go, I don't want to, uh. Oh, yay. Go back to your house. Alright, so she has to leave. She has to go back home. I'm gonna follow her. So the thing is, like I was saying, vampires, at least in her case, are nocturnal beings. So she doesn't want to be out in the daytime, in the sun. So I'm just gonna follow her. Being all sneaky like. Where everybody can see me. Oh, now I'm hidden. Broad daylight. This will help increase my sneaking ability. You can't see me. <laughs> People are just investigating that dead spider that just popped out of nowhere. Alright, so her house is... Right over there. Alright, so I'm gonna wait an hour. So she should be at home now. We're gonna go pay her a little visit. We're gonna make a house call. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. You the dude. Yes, you're the dude. Here for work. Get an axe and bring uh, me all the. I saw your daughter's ghost. Really? How nice. That's not the reaction that I, I expected. Have Alva to take care of now. I don't need Helgi anymore. Okay, you're a thrall. She came by so Alva could kiss her goodbye. Then she left to join the storm. Club. Nah, I think that's. I th <laughs> he was cruel to her. He would beat her every night. It's no wonder she fled in the middle of the night. It's not true. I didn't hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not. Oh, hi, Hrogar. Good day. And yes, I know. I mixed up that. <laughs> I never get that phrasing right. All right, time to snoop. So hopefully, I've timed this correctly. Hrogar is not in the house. It's daylight. Whoa, Lydia, you are a little too close, but I like your eye color. It's very pretty. Okay. I'm just gonna steal while I'm here. No, nah, I don't need a loot. Time to head towards the cellar, where they keep all the, the pickled jams and everything. Oh, look. Let me see if I can improve my pickpocketing skills. Change my outfit here. There we go. Just in case. Nice. Nice. Whoop. <laughs> oh, God. Never should have come here. So you did have the ability to basically shoot and kill her while she was in her own coffin. But um, I wanted to see if I could level up that pickpocketing ability. I'm gonna take everything, because I don't think Tavern's Clothes is an actually item that you can find. Like, normally it's like a dress, a regal dress, 
fancy stuff, but nothing that says tavern. So I'm going to take everything. I'm also going to take your journal. I'm going to read your journal. Read your private thoughts. So basically, this lady's a vampire. No, wait, wait. So the plan was, basically her plan went foobar. That, uh, Krogar burned his family alive when she meant to make it look like an accident. But now she's saying there's a stranger in town, and that's me. So, she's working for somebody else. So she's not the head honcho in this scenario. Alright, I am too heavy. I'm over encumbered. Time to put on my walking clothes. Or not my walking clothes, my walking boots. Boots of hauling. Also, steal everything that I can in her house. Ew. Here, let me give you a hand. Now I think at this point, it would be safe to say, since she's dead, I don't think this should be considered as stealing. But what do I know? No, Rogar is not going to be happy with me. Considering he's still a thrall. Yeah, look, there's fine clothes. Um, let's see. Take those eggs. <gasps> Cabbage! Oh, there's nothing in there. Yeah, there is actually a uh, possibility of him being in the house while you're here. And you're not supposed to be in here, so he will attack you. Oh, wait. Uh, nothing. No, I don't want to be in here if he comes back in. So I'm just gonna sneak on out. Go to the Jarl to do some major snitching. Hey, Jarl! I got some news for you. Man, that courier is like committed. He's still here. Alright. Time to go turn this quest in and get part two. Is Grogar innocent or not? Mmm. No, not really. I think she had it in her. Well, she doesn't anymore. <laughs> it's like actually she's a vampire. I assume you have proof. Can't go making accusations like that. What about this proof. So it's her true. diary. Traitor is <gasps> 500 gold. Nice. Debt. <laughs> that you traitor's bitch. You promised a reward for solving the crime, but I need one more favor from you. If I be can become a thane, I'll do it. Danger. The journal mentions Mohar, a master vampire I thought was destroyed a century ago. Who I actually kind of killed I earlier, but... I gather some able-bodied warriors to clean out Mohar's lair. They'll be waiting outside for you to lead them. Uh, alright. That's it. Mm -hmm. Alright. So I gotta get ahead outside. Do a quick save. Yeah, I had actually visited Morthal earlier before this quest. And, uh, I had actually cleared out that vampire den. But of course it didn't take, because this quest hadn't popped yet. Kill him. Who? Oh, yeah. Movarth. Uh, the gods know what you know. Man, look at everyone. She's just already. I think I can teach you a thing. You, oh, no. I've maxed. What is that guard doing in the water? Are you okay, sir? All right. She's dead. Laelette. I want vengeance for my wife. Revenge. Vengeance for Laelette. Revenge. We're marching on Movarth's lair, whether you come with us or not. I am coming. I'm leading it. Well, I guess I'm not leading it, but I'm going. Nope. Sorry. No. So this is the band of misfits that are gonna go take down this vampire. What's up, fellow kids? Sorry, I'm trying to adjust my headset again. I think I got it high enough. So off we go. This is much more impressive if you do this at night. Because everyone's carrying around like pitchforks, or not pitchforks, but uh, torches. 
has a certain kind of atmosphere. It's very impressive. But we're doing this in broad daylight. Alright. Now let's see who's gonna check it out. I'm just a poor man trying to make it. <laughs> I'd leave Mortal were it in my power. It's like, uh, what was the whole point of you all joining me they here? They may be cowards, but I'm not. I'll go with you. So, you do have the option of letting him stay here. Typically, I do let him stay here, and I go, so, look at all those cowards. Look at them. They were just here to run. But, uh, I think... I'm actually gonna say, yeah. Because I don't think I've ever actually let him join me. Leads on. So now I got the difficulty of trying to make sure he makes it alive. They may but, be cowards, uh, but I'm not. Yeah, let's see. I'll go with you. Do you duck as well? Ooh, what, what do you got in your pockets? Eh, not bad. Looking spree. It doesn't hurt to look. So it's way too high now. Okay. Still trying to adjust. I was playing with it when I shouldn't have. Now it's, everything's kind of too loud. Alright, so he can see me. So I don't know if that's going to affect... Oh no. The spiders know I'm here because of him. He's just throwing off my whole sneaking game. There we go. And... Like, dude, you're not made here for sneaking and going stealth. But I'm gonna poison my arrow. Why do you got gold on you, spider? Wait, wait, wait. There we go. Alright, so this place is just filled with vampires. So if I can play my cards right, I won't have to really fight any of them. That's a thrall, and I missed. How am I missing? There we go. Okay, time to steal off of you. Just adjust my headset. Dude, don't get in my way. I don't want to accidentally hit you with friendly fire. Someone in there. I just know it. Yep. Time to end this little game. Oh, I keep missing. I am not doing well. There we go. Sign him. Oh no! Sleeping people. Yeah, the funny thing is, I've actually been through here before. So it's like. Ooh, nice. Sneak. I think it's because he is here and he can normally see me, so when he doesn't see me, that improves my skill. Oh, one second. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I had to clear my throat. Alright, what shaft do I have currently? There we go. Uh, let's go for disarm, see if that helps any. And can I poison my bow? Not sure how effective that'll be against a vampire. Because I think they can also turn invisible, at least some of them. So, quick save. And... I don't think they're going to give me any monologue. There we go. Nice. <laughs> Now I just gotta get rid of these chumps. There are other vampires in this cave, too. Here we go. So I was like, look at that. I didn't have to do really any work. Uh, it's like, this outfit's cool, but I'm gonna leave it. Ooh, ouch. 
take that, take your outfit, take your dignity. Oh, now I'm too heavy. Take your gold. Take that meat of questionable origin, considering you're all vampires. Jumping on your table. Yeah, quote unquote raw beef. I'm picking up more than I intended, but I can just dump stuff off the table. Let's see. Okay, just toss that. Let's see. Uh, is there anything else I can dump? This cheese. It's heavy cheese. Drink that wine. I'm getting there. What else can I just get rid of? I'm gonna lose four pounds quick. Mmm. Mmm. <clears throat> So that's 62 and 4. Ah, oh, it's 70 and 4. Goodbye, light armor. Can I move? Oh, no. I'm gonna lose something else. Let me just eat something real quick. There we go. Now I can move. So I think there's another vampire back here. So that whole showdown with Vampire Lord was very anticlimactic. Oh. Actually. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Oh wait, no. It's nothing. It wasn't effective at all. Okay, I gotta chug some potions. If I have something for health. Yes, I do. I gotta change out my shout too. You are too powerful, sir. Alright. Nice! Cinematic kill. Very nice. Ew. You look gross there for a second. It's like the music knows. Immortal blood. It's twilight. Alright, let's see. Level. Healing. I think there's- yes! Treasure chest. It's like I knew it was around here somewhere. Uh, oh no. I'm over encumbered again. Uh, let's see. What can I eat? That should be enough. Where's- where's that dude? Do we lose him? Please don't tell me he just wandered off. He probably left without me. Alright, there's another vampire in here. Oh, got stuck. There we go. Nice. Oh, thanks, Stay Hydrated Bot, for reminding me to take a drink. Actually, I'm gonna do that right now. While I'm thinking about it. Now would be a good time for everyone to stretch, stand up, take a drink. Good, good, good. Okay. Time to move on. Let's see. Ooh, potion. It's like, I need to find somewhere quick to sell my stuff. Or go back to, I think, Whiterun to, to my house to dump stuff off. Ew, skull, and I can't touch it. That's not fair. <laughs> well, that's one way. Where did that dude go? I forget what his name was. Thronier? He was following me. I 
there's another vampire this way. I think. But here's some of their sleeping quarters. That I can just start stealing their stuff. Oh, wait, one way to definitely find out. Try and sleep. Yep, enemy. You can't sleep when there's enemies around. Ooh, I don't like that red hand. Do your worst. The shoe could contract vampirism this way. Stop. No. Get back, Twilight. I don't know you. Alright, so look at all these boots. Whoever, I think this is Movarth's bed. Yeah. So since I was here before, I found his boots of lifting. So I don't think they're going to be available now. Look at all these boots. There's a shoe horse. Yeah, they're like hide boots right here. And I think I have them, but I think they're at my house in White Run. Alright, so let's just leave. And first I just want to double check that I did not contract vampirism. Nope. Just ataxia. Stupid rat. I have to find a shrine and pray to it. Alright, let's... Oh, dude. I'm just a poor man trying to make a living. You did nothing. I'd leave more Ooh, more iron. <laughs> it's like I'm distracted easily. I think we're done Stand here, sir. War has cost us me everything. Time to leave. He'll make his way out on his own. He'll be fine. More boots. Clothes. So it's just a little narrative detail to show that they've been at this for a while. This is not their first vampire rodeo, but it was their last. Because they're dead. Alright, so... Yep. This quest is over. We're heading on out. I'm gonna talk to the, the Thane. Or not Thane, but I'm gonna talk to the Jarl to become a Thane. And we've put your spirit to rest. Mother's calling What's up, me? kid? It's time for me to sleep now. I'm so tired. Thank you for making her feel that- I avenged you. Goodbye, kid. And just like that, we're done. To Skyrim. Alright, let's go back, talk to the R. I'll be like, yeah, I uh, took care of that vampire problem of yours. Now pay me. Wait, I'll make sure Lydia's- There you are, okay. I'm gonna make sure Lydia's following me. Now, I don't think your followers can actually contract vampirism. I don't think. I think it's just you. Because that would be super awful if she contracted that. And where's this- oh. You want to talk to me after everything- Dude, you were a thrall. Are you feeling sick? You murdered your wife and child. I- I'm not one for talk. Try to keep to myself. It's like, don't blame me. I just solved all this problem. Just took care of all those issues. So I think after this, I'm gonna head towards Solitude. Because that's where the main quest is actually gonna take me. Because I think I have to meet, uh... Is it Delphine? I have to meet her there. Alright, what's up, Jarl? Well, look at you. If only everyone acted like you did. Yeah, but I have main protagonist powers. By the eight, I didn't think he could do it. What? Now maybe we can put all this. You didn't behind. have any faith in me? Take Jarl, I'm I'm rest. shocked. <gasps> Eight hundred gold. Nice. Anything else? There is room in my court for you. Yeah. Him. It's an honorary title mainly. But there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. Now before the Hearthfire DLC. There was no property available, but I believe once I become Thane, I can purchase the property. Uh, yeah. Did I do it? Oh, two out of three. What else do I need to do? So, helping out with that ghost issue already helps you well on your way to becoming a Thane. But what do I have to do to help another person? I don't remember. Well, 
I'll get to it eventually. Time to head towards solitude. Why are there dead mud crabs near this house? Is that a bug? Also, for some reason, I'm now over encumbered. Okay, now I'm not. Time to go. Lydia, let's escape this hellhole. This haunted place. The solitude. Just don't need any roads. I'm just gonna do straight through. Also, I think if I continue on this way, I'm gonna find a, is it a sigil stone? But I like the one that I currently have, but I do wanna locate it. Keeping my guard up. Making sure if I see anything. No, it sounds okay. Oh, oh, God. Oh. Stupid mud crab. I didn't even realize it was biting me. Anything in here? Probably just mud crabs. Yep. Whoa! Haha. -ha. Watching your health bar quickly diminish. What is this? Take that book. Take this. I'm gonna open this. What's in here? Uh, no, I'll leave that there. But now I am over encumbered once again. It's like I can't get, I can't wait to get to town so I can actually sell my stuff. Oh, Lydia's out there fighting mud crabs. Oh wait, there she is. Come on, magic, replenish, muffle my feet. Tiny, silent cat feet. Oh. There we go. Back on the road again. We're going the right way. There's an enemy over here somewhere. Oh no, Lydia! Oh, she took care of it. You strong, girl. I'm so proud of you, Lydia. You will keep me safe. Oh. Bye, dear. Your soul is mine. Alright, so I'm at least gonna locate this sigil stone. But I don't think I'm gonna take it. Whoa! Oh no, I missed. You got lucky this time, dear. I hear there's a Nern root around here somewhere. All right, what's this one do? I uh, recover magic faster, but you're more susceptible to magical damage. Uh, no, cancel. I do not want to swap out what I have. Right now, I have the Thief Stone, which increases the is it the rate at which I level up my thiefing abilities. <gasps> Which I do want. Nope. I need to improve my archery abilities. Torch bug. Oh wait, there's a house over here that I won't be able to get into just yet. But I do want to locate it. Actually, that's kind of far away. I'm going to ignore that house then. Oh, wait. <gasps> it's like I never saw it coming. Okay. Let's see. 
Oh, no soul gem large enough. I guess I'm full up on soul gems. Okay, what is fighting me? It's like the music kicked in. Oh, God. Oh, I missed. That's not good. Oh, it just walked into my frost. This, normally, I'm so used to just seeing in the Dwarven Ruins. I'm surprised it's up and about. These are horrible creatures. Now let's see if I can heal myself. And something else popped up over here. Whoa! There we go. But I can take its poison. It's sweet, sweet poison. Let's see. Just checking the gen- Oh. I guess the spider killed that mud crab. Just checking the general area. Making sure I don't run into an ambush. There's a lot of unfound territory over there. Ooh. Canis root. It's over here. This looks interesting. Is there anything interesting over here? No, I don't think anything else. So I could go swimming. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Swim across. Do I wanna go over by that mill? Or the boatyard. Uh, mill. <gasps> Fish. Oh no, I'm too heavy now. <gasps> no. All right, let's see if I can eat anything to gain its power. Wait. There we go. Anything new? Nope. Wait, wait. Still too heavy. Okay. There we go. Oh, I'm so tempted to grab these fish, though. But I have no room for these fish. Or I am too heavy. Someone just left a potion on this pier. Wait, wait. Let me get on here. Wait. There we go. Ah, someone went sailing and drinking. Lydia, where are you? <gasps> Lydia! No, oh, there you are. Okay. You would think with all the armor that we're wearing, it would weigh us down. Well, let's see, can I cook something over here? Can I cook? No. It's just nothing but an empty pot. Ooh, I could take these leather strips, but once again, I am going to be too heavy. Alright, nothing to improve upon. What's up, dude? What you thinking? Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just don't know it yet. Nah, it's just me. Wait. Whoa! There we go. So hopefully a new courier will bring me another letter. <gasps> Chicken! Uh, nothing. Ooh, mud crab, way over there. Now nah, I'm gonna leave it alone. What's up, dude? Come in, come in. I was just about to take a break. Where are you? Living outside the walls is a risk, aye. But at least the guards don't come nosing around. Gotta stay away from those guards, eh? I'm going to take off my map marker. Alright, I'm going to town. I need to sell stuff. I'm way too heavy. So I continue on. Where's the stables? The map marker's over here. Oh, I know. Okay. Lamp post. Aw, the 
look at these horses. And a chicken. No, I don't want to steal you guys. Right, do you guys have any quests? It don't look so good. Are you feeling all right? No, I have ataxia. Work hard for the future, and leave the past be. That's my motto. All right, no, I don't want to buy a horse. It would not serve me well. For my purposes, the horse I would be afraid of is just dying constantly. Plus. I, later on, will be able to get a horse during one of my quests. But that may not be for some time, but I'm willing to wait. Rather than spend, like, a thousand gold for one horse. Actually, give me one second. I want to double check. Where is... Where's this dude? Oh, see? Like I said, they're traveling caravan. So that guy, he's closer to, closer to Riften now. Whoa, look at all that stuff in Riften. Alright, well, that'll just have to wait for another evening. Right now, I am going here. Also, if there's another caravan close by, I believe the Khajiit set up their camp here. Because once again... Because she are not the legion speak to Ricker. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here. Or you'll end up like Rogbeer. Oh, who's Rogbeer? Oh, like I was saying, uh, once again, Skyrim does not like Khajiit, and they're not welcome in any of the holds. We're just in time to say hello to Rogbeer. Who is Rogbeer? He's the sorry bastard who's going to be executed. Oh, I was on a headlock once. Stormcloak escaped the Oh. After he killed the High King. Yeah, Solitude is where the High King used to be, until Ulfric shouted him to death. Which now become Dragonborn, it's a bit more understandable how much damage I can do. And you're just hiding in the bushes. You're just in time to say hello to Rugbeer. You're that same voice actor that was over there. Alright, time to quick save. Wait, wait. Wrong button. Yeah. Let's go say hi to Rogvir, shall we? Now, unfortunately for Rogvir, I don't think a dragon's gonna come in and save him like it did me. Now, you do have the option of interrupting this execution, but everyone's gonna become hostile to you in like a heartbeat, so there's no purpose. You betrayed us! I'm gonna sit down here on this rock. Get a good seat. Uncle is scum that betrayed his high king. Best she know now, Advar. Some gate guard you are! Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Tori. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric challenged Tori. Nah. King in fair combat. Shouting is no fair, fair way to fight. I should know. I've shouted many things to death. Boo! Boo this man! Boo! Well, time to go. On this day, I go to Sovngarde. Ugh. And you all witnessed it. All right, time to talk to people. Shh. Go away. Jeez, you're a welcoming a bunch. I still can't believe he knew what he was doing when he opened that gate. A man opens a gate and they cut his head off? Doesn't he seem right to me. should have drawn it out some more. He deserved a right slower now. death. Rogvir. So none of these people oh, are, uh, really available. Let's see. What you got? Ooh! Nice! I'm gonna take that. I, don't know what I, I just got myself a free amulet. Sweet! That helps me with my shouts. Let's see. Yep, there we go. I think that's a bug. I think it's always a bug, because it says time between shouts reduced by 0%. Hey, dude. In my city, lass. 
This here axe no way to get ahead in light. Sight. Let's see if I can reconnect you. I think they expected more. There we go. There you go, buddy. Have been like this. Oh, Need I have a letter for you. For me? From whom? Uh, from Gorm. Well, now, that is something. Hand it over, please. He told me I could read it. Oh, no. I hadn't heard from Gorm for a while, so I'd hoped he'd given up his little scheme. Uh-oh, that's the not last good. The time we discussed this issue was before this damnable war broke out. Things were different then. Now, what he's asking, it's just impossible. Even he's if he trying to overthrow the, the Jarl of Morthal. Well, I'll take it under advisement. Thank you. Um, pay me? Okay, good. <gasps> nice! I've just assisted three out of three people. I can become a Thane. Their aim could be steadier, but their battle ready. Nice. Can any man hope to be ready for a dragon? I can. I can, but hone their skills and harden their hearts. The rest is up to the gods. Just the egg gods, because the Thalmor don't like it when you pray to the ninth. Not my finest hour. Rogvir was a fine and honorable man. Yeah, I'm sure he was. Uh, what'd well, you think? I think he was entirely wrong. Rogvir's execution was justified. He let Ulfric escape. Being honorable might make you a good man, but it doesn't make you right. Be a better world if it did. Alright, time to leave. My men in your prayers. What's up, dude? See ya. Thanks for the necklace. Oh, I think I have to give this necklace to their family. Darn. Spare some gold for a veteran? Uh, yeah, I want gift of charity perk. Oh, thank you. Come on, upper left hand corner, upper left hand corner, come on. Nice, gift of charity. It's a bonus. You see a man falling on hard times, and you think he's been like that forever? Yes. I was no. I fought in the Great War. The Great War. I was on the field at Anvil. And when I was struck down, they left me. You understand? Oh, no. They left me for dead. I didn't leave them. Fell on some hard times, baby. It's best you leave me be. Ooh, I do love the signs. Like, the details that they put in this. The vines bless you. May the ground All right, so this is a tailor. It's like it tells you just what you need to know. Let's go have them thumb up their nose at my attire. Oh, let me just drop everything to help you. I don't mind, really. Are you sure you, uh... Do you get a lot of business like that? Raiment has the finest attire in all of Skyrim. That is how... Ah, oh, by acting like a snob. It is when my customers waste time chatting and not buying. I can't wait to steal all this stuff. Take a look. Oh, wait. I gotta change out my attire to improve my chances for bartering and haggling. So, necklace and hat. There you go. I'm now ready to do I business. Purchases. Let's see if we can't find an outfit that suits you. Is that a pun? Is that a pun, miss? Alright, so a lot of kids' outfits. And... Hmm. pretty so it's like a lot of these clothes do me no good because they don't have any armor like there's no armor rating on them huh that's interesting ah mourner's clothes mourner's hat uh, it's like a lot of these necklaces I would only really get just to break them down for enchanting to promote the store, I guess. <gasps> nice! Well, let's see. Right, let's see, what can I sell you? So, yes, madam, what can I help you with? Time to sell some of my things that I no longer need. It's like, that's why I also enchant necklaces and rings, because they're lightweight. And I can sell them for money. Oh, she's running short on clothes. Not short on clothes, short on cash. So that's all I'm going to sell you. 
Thank the gods for the end of yet another pointless conversation. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, don't look at me take your stuff. Oh, oh. Hmm. 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 Nope. Oh. Quick save. All right, don't look at me. All right, let's do up, right, left, diagonals. Oh. This axe work. So this is gonna be hard because I haven't upgraded my lock picking skills at all on the on the uh, perk tree, as it were. The perk constellation. Ah! Alright. Try it once more. And I can't push this too fast. I'm getting impatient. Nice thing is I do have over 99 lockpicks. Oh no! Alright, so I remember it was kind of... Nice. Time to take all that. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's like, it's so kind of hard to see some of these. Oh, she sees me. Look away. Wait. Lydia, you don't cow. Oh, she sees me over there. Take these circlets. It's like, I do like these circlets. They're very pretty, but they're just, there's no armor rating on them. Oh, now I'm over encumbered. Uh, do I have anything? No. Grab a new weapon. Poison that. Poison that. Oh no, I'm still too heavy. Shove some food in my face. There we go. <gasps> Another circlet. Always, oh, they're too heavy. They're like two pounds a piece. What? Wait a minute. Why is this fish half a pound? All right, eat that fish. Eat that bone meal. Uh, eat that egg. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, I just noticed. Hello. Music lover. Zachax Trinity. Tr uh, Trinity. Sorry, I have to remind myself to keep checking out chat just to make sure in the off chance that someone comes in and says hi. Hello, how you doing? Sorry for the, the late response. Oh, okay, cool. Trin, how's it going? Hope you're having a good evening. Thanks for stopping it by, stopping in. Right now I'm, I've just made it to solitude and I'm stealing as much as I can. But of course, that makes me a little bit too heavy so I gotta find someone to sell my goods to. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. It's time for you to go. Oh, late. this lady's kicking me out. I can't even check to see what time it is. All right, well, I've stolen enough from her, so I feel good about that. <laughs> oh, that's why she kicked me out. It's late, so she was closing up. There's some gold for a veteran. Yeah, I already gave you, you a buck, a but system. oh, I can't give you any more. Must deny during the Great War, or I earn it myself. Not uh, what's this place? I think it's alchemy. You might want to... All right. Well, this place seems like it's still open. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. See, at least this person's nice and inviting. How do you feel? I think you might be. Sick. I have ataxia. I know. Everybody comments Aaron's on my it. My husband. He works the forge up at Castle Dower. I barely see him nowadays, what with him filling orders for the army. Aww. Uh, were you at the execution? No, that was an ugly affair. High King Torig's death has turned the whole town on its head. Was that a pun? Was that a pun for an execution? <laughs> for a beheading? King. All of those rambling speeches about- Jeez, not one to speak ill of the dead, are you? Uh, what do you got for sale? All this junk? Me? I call them treasures treasure let's look for treasure oh nice i can sell her stuff 
if I can finally unload all this junk. But uh, I have to be careful. I don't want to sell her any of these emeralds and jewels because even though they're light, I might get more money for them. Uh, but I gotta sell stuff that's heavy. Wait, wait, there we go. All right, so I wanna keep that, keep this. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of that. Nice, <gasps> yes, yes, level up, awesome. So right now I'm getting rid of some heavy items and just trying to max out what she has to sell or uh, all the gold she has. So I wanna keep this elven armor, see if I can upgrade that. All right, so that's 18 and one. Oh, 20 and one, all right, goodbye light boots. Uh, 18 and one, 21. Mm, let's see, uh... Yeah, there we go. So slowly but surely I'm whittling down her her uh, gold. Let's see. Oh no, that's no problem, Trin. Sorry, I I've mentioned before in my streams, uh the way that I stream my TV is basically to my twelve o'clock, my computer's to my three. So I gotta keep reminding myself to, to check chat every now and then. So I, I apologize for the, the late replies. I'm not ignoring anybody. Um, but no, that's okay. I've, I've been there. I've definitely, sometimes when I go to close a tab, I hit uh, command Q to quit instead of command W. And I'm like, I can't believe I just did that. It happens. All right, let's see if I can rid this lady of her gold, lighten her purse. Alright, let's see. Let me sell you some food. Maybe not. Alright, so I don't want to sell her anything too high a value because then I'd be taking a hit on what I could sell. I mean, I'm trying to make sense here. It's like, I don't want to sell her this because she is less gold than what it's worth. So, all right. That's all you got? Bits and pieces Whoa. What's up, kid? I, I bet my papa could beat you up. I bet he couldn't. Go get your dad. Them's fighting me. words. I'm going to fight your dad. Too, so I tried to use the forge. Oh, thanks, Trent. Yeah, but feel free if you had any questions or if you'd like to check, go right ahead. But if you'd like just to listen and watch, that's not a problem at all either. Fearin said you got here just before the execution. Must have been a lovely first sight. Oh yeah, it was a, a welcoming party to the Solitude Town. Just, who doesn't enjoy a good old execution? Alright, so even though this is a shop, it's also their house. So let me just close this door just in case my hands uh, get a little itchy. Like this. I'm taking the sweet roll. And the salmon. And the cheese. <laughs> oh yeah, go right ahead, Trin. Not a problem. I'll try and uh, remind myself to look over to chat. But yeah, go. feel free. Go right ahead. I'll try to answer them to the best of my abilities. Ooh, look at all this stuff I can steal. And I've now recently acquired some extra carrying weight capabilities. It's like no one sees me do this. Ooh, pelt. <gasps> no, it's a goat pelt. I know I can pick it up, but it's not letting me. That's not fair. This house is cheating. Yes, I am. I just uh, saw your question. Yes, I am a girl. <laughs> I know sometimes it's not uh, entirely, you can't entirely tell sometimes in some streams, but I am, yes. All right, let's see, can I open up this? Yes, there we go. Taking all their money. It's like these people should really invest more in a home security system. 
Look at this, they're just leaving their gold out where anybody could come in and take it, like me. Time to leave this place. Alright, let's see. How do you feel? I think you might Everyone, I gotta find a shrine to pray to, otherwise everyone's gonna keep talking about my illness. I have ataxia, and right now that's... Ooh, I can level up, I forgot. <laughs> Thanks. I totally forgot that I was able to, to level up. All right, so let's level up my health, because I haven't really touched that much. Uh, I could level up enchanting. I do like to enchant. But right now I'm not really strong enough, so I'm going to wait on that. Uh, I don't think... Hmm. I could, but I would need two points. I don't think I'm wearing any heavy armor. I don't really block. Right now I do have a sword that's two-handed. Uh, what can I improve for archery? All right, I'll leave that go. I could increase my lock picking capabilities. But I think I'm pretty good without it. I'd rather focus on some of my other perks. Hmm. It's like eventually I want to get to fence capability. An investor's good. I'm definitely gunning for a thief build in this game. Uh, let me increase my steel smithing. Because once I hit 60, I can then improve my magical weapons. But in the meantime, next level, I can either choose to do dwarf or elven. So, and thankfully, you look You're shady. New. I'm new too. Oh, you have a quest. I can just I smell it on solitude. you. Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? I am, sir. It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground. Or just left lying around in someone's house. It's like you know I me. the two of us, we're very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. Yeah, I can help you find a shirt. A you look cold. We like to collect things. Uh, I'm listening. I knew you looked like a clever one. I know where this mission's gonna go, too. ships <laughs> come through these docks, loaded with weapons and pay, but few people, and they pass through dangerous waters. We have an uh, interest in thanks. One of those boats, the Ice Runner. I, uh, I've played Skyrim many times before, so it's like, these are some of the games that I enjoy playing, because I know kind of what I'm doing, so I can kind of like half pay attention to the game, and pay attention to talking. I'm still new to streaming somewhat, so I'm trying to like kind of ease into it. So during the weekends I play Skyrim, and then during the week, Monday through Thursday, I'm playing uh, Mass Effect 3 currently. What an interesting idea. But yeah, let's put out that lighthouse fire. If someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. I do enjoy loot yes. and money. If someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. It's a shame you can't find someone, but look! I've just been updated on my map. Uh, I'm not gonna rat him out. I'm not, not gonna snitch on him. Because this might be very profitable. Uh, what happens to the Don't sailors? Don't worry huh? about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from I think south. you're lying. Alright. It would be best if we spoke little until you've completed your task. Are there any other shops that are open? So I've already gone into bits and pieces. Uh, is this the inn? No. Okay. I think this is the alchemy shop. Yes, exactly. You, I think, can teach me. Welcome to Angela's Aromatics. You're a traveler, correct? Yes. Have you been to White Run? I have. Why is that the first option I have? Yes. Wonderful. I hadn't really hoped to run into someone who'd been there. My daughter Fura was well, you're assigned a lot, to White Run after she joined the Imperial Army. 
I was hoping you might have met. Oh, I haven't heard from her lately. I don't think this is going to well. I've tried well. talking to Captain Aldous, but he hasn't been any help. Uh, I'll try, because I can smell a side quest on this. Oh, that's very sweet of you. Anything you can find out from Captain Aldous would be welcome news. Is this info worth a discount? No, no. Mostly, I'm just a simple herbalist. Oh. Lamy over in Mothal. I was just there, and she did train me. Uh, don't I don't think... Next time you need herbs and potions... Look at all the stuff I could just steal. There's just so much. I'm so tempted. Are you feeling all right, dear? Oh, I'm gonna go find a shrine. I'm tired of people telling me I look sick. <laughs> uh, just check and chat now. Uh, usually you go to bed around... Oh, okay. Um, oh yeah, yeah, that's definitely fine. I actually, I plan on streaming till 10, so that's about nine minutes away. So I'm not going to be on too much longer, and I just noticed that I have someone else hosting me, so let me give them a quick shout out. Alright, let's see. Okay, so a quick shout out to Das Grizzo. hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Thank you for the host, I appreciate it. See, so yeah, typically I stream uh, from 8 to 10 on on nights, uh, most nights, with the exception of Friday. But yeah, you can stay however late you want, or you can leave whenever you like. I appreciate you stopping by, chatting with me. It's always appreciated. Let's see if there's anything I can improve on the grindstone at the moment. Oh, I got nothing. Can I make anything, though? I can make some leather items. I don't think I have anything to improve my smithing capabilities. Uh, let's see. And of course, the shop is closed at the moment, so I can't buy or sell anything. Can I make any jewelry? Nope. Alright, let me make some bracers, because right now I can make at least ten of them. Let me improve at least two of them. That's all I can do at the moment. Let me see if I have any pelts. Lydia, I forgot. You're my uh, pack horse. I am pack mule. Give me your stuff. Let me miscellaneous. Oh. You don't have anything. I'm gonna take these though. I'm gonna take those so I can sell them the next time I get to a shop. Uh, I'm gonna take your sword because you're not using it. Okay. That's it. You lead, I'll follow. Oh no, now I'm too heavy. Yeah, Trey, it looks like I am ahead of you as far as time zones. I'm on the, uh, the East Coast. Okay, let's see if I can improve something. Oh no, I'm too slow. Hop my way over there. <laughs> there we go. Let's see, I think if I improve these, it's gonna get rid of that leather. So, I gotta, I gotta lose eight pounds. Lydia, come back. I need to give you my junk. Still here. How can I serve you, my thing? You can serve me by taking this stuff off my hands. Uh, what do I want to give you, though? Is there anything that would be beneficial to you? Mm, yeah, I'll give you that. I don't think you're really gonna wear any of that, though. Nah, the stuff you have right now is better. Lead on. Yep, you didn't change at all. Oh wait, did I? I didn't lose enough pounds. Uh, just drinking. Just eat all these potatoes. In honor of St. Patrick's Day, I'm just eating a bunch of potatoes. All right, before I end stream, I do, I do want to get over to one of those temples. I think it's over here. Just so I can pray this ataxi away. Oh, that's actually a good idea, Trent. Thank you. Normally I keep stuff that I've stolen on my on my person, but that is actually a very good idea. I don't think I've ever really done that before. 
typically, if I do happen to get caught, I uh, pay a fine, and then I head back to the jail to steal the stuff out of the, the chest of contraband. Oh, it's like, who do I pray to now? Hmm, choices. Uh, forget which does exactly what. But anyway, that's Mara Julianos, I think? Yeah. Akatosh Debella. Uh, Kine? No, Kinnereth. Are you feeling sick? Talos would be here. What's up, Roland? As priest of the eight divines, I bid you welcome. Oh, I see a ninth ninth pillar right here that needs a, a shrine soon. We welcome you to worship. Stendar, I think, helps my blocking ability. RK is the goddess or god of death, I think. Uh, this, I think, will help me with pricing, bartering, yes. So that's good to use in a town like this. And I no longer have ataxia. It's a win-win for me right here. Kinnareth has blessed you with tremendous compassion, Silana. You will find Wait, a way. Wait, somebody. There we go. Do you have a quest for me? To you. The Whoa. Are listening. The divines... Why do you keep jumping? I'm trying to talk to this lady. Of the eight divines upon you. How may I Thank you. Uh, this girl keeps jumping. Hmm? Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, yeah. That once held the shrine to Talos. But the worship of Talos was banned by the White Gold Concordat some time ago. Yeah, that's what the Thalmor do not like. It's the peace treaty that ended the war with the elves of the Almeri Dominion. The Dominion recognized the heresy of proclaiming Talos a god. Talos was a great man. Yeah, so he was raised to godhood. That does not make him a god. No matter how much the Stormcloaks may wish it were so. Uh, what? I know what they do. But I'm gonna Those ask it anyway. Shines will sometimes receive boons from the gods themselves. Yeah, I receive the perks. Of the favors varies per deity. Please feel free to worship at any or all of the shrines. So you could worship at all the shrines if you want, but you only get one perk at uh, at a time. Wait. Oh, why is it considered stealing though? I take it anyway. I just stole those berries. What are you gonna do about it, shrine worshippers? Come and take these. In fact, just to spite you, I'm gonna eat that. Ha! Can't take it back now. Alright, so I know there is a mission I can turn in here somewhere. So I'm at least gonna go stand over there. Just so I can prepare myself for the next time I play. Because I am getting close to ending. But I know, I think there's a barrel from the Thieves Guild around here. Whoa! Ow! Hawk! Hawks. Can I do it? Did I do it? I think I did it. I think I shot it. Did I? Did I? It would have fallen around here somewhere. Oh. That's the thing, if you actually manage to shoot down a hawk, you can uh, loot its corpse for like a beak and wings and feathers. For alchemy purposes. But I don't know if I actually shot it down or not. It does- oh wait, there it is. Let's see. Attempt number two. <gasps> yes! Give me- oh no! Give me your wings. Oh no, it's up on that rampart. Or that wall, I can't get it. I've been cheated. Oh well. I don't think I'm gonna get it. I don't think there's really any way to get up there. There's another hawk up there. I don't think, I thought there was a barrel around here, but I guess I was wrong. Because in some towns you'll find, like, a Thieves' Guild cache that you can loot and find weapons and such. Like, they have a Thieves' Guild mark on them, too. But unfortunately, I'm not seeing it. Wait. Wait. Can I get through here? Nope. But I don't mean to do that. I need to crouch. Come on, let me through. Let 
Come on. I'm trying to climb this mountain. This barrel mountain. Oh, I can't. Ow. <gasps> I got really close to clipping through that wall there. I got worried. It's like, I don't remember the last time I saved. It's like, I really want that hawk, though, that I shot down. I feel cheated. Hmm. All right, well. Oh, well. There'll be other hawks. Go fiddling with any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. Speaking of locks... Ah! So I think this means that this house has nothing of importance. Tendrils. It's empty. Whoa! But those tendrils. Oh, you have a quest for you, me. You help me. You help people, right? That's what you do. Oh, thanks, Trin. I'll see you tomorrow. You have a good night. Thanks again for stopping by. I'm actually going to be ending soon. I, uh, it's just about 10 o'clock, so as soon as I'm done talking to this guy, oh, thank I'm going to save, I'm going to end, and I'm going to uh, stream again tomorrow. My master has abandoned me. Abandoned his people. Ooh, there's a hawk up there. Nothing I say can change his mind. Now he refuses to even see me. He says I interrupt his vacation. It's been so many years. So this guy has a really fun quest. Last I saw him, he was visiting a friend in the Blue Palace. Ah, Blue no Palace, eh? Yarrow. No, no, such people. <laughs> no, he went into the forbidden wing of the palace to speak. It's with an old friend. forbidden. Said it had been ages since it's they had. It's the West had Wing. Him. Oh, and you'll need the hip bone. Excuse me. <laughs> no entering Pelagius's wing without that. Uh, okay. Um, oh, you just don't understand. He just gave me a hip bone. <laughs> Without him, I am doomed. All of his empire shall fall into chaos. So this sounds important. So, all right. So I'm just going to uh, stand by the bar's college door to remind myself this is where I want to go next week. So that's it for tonight. Let me do a quick save and a hard save and rotate my saves. Okay, let me get stuff. On my uh, profile as well so feel free to join me there uh, thank you again to the lovely followers who are hosting my stream that's overload overload uh, YT Bill Pill and Das Crozo thank you again for the host and speaking of host let's see who I can send you all to tonight I think I have someone in mind as long as they're still streaming ah yes She's still streaming. So I'm gonna get this raid started. So I'm gonna send you all to that violin chick who Im specializes in improvisation for her violin. So like I said, thank you all for coming out tonight. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a good evening and a good night and I'll see you again all tomorrow. Take care.